Welcome everyone, I am John Ryan for Gambling.com and this is the NCAA Football Angle of the Week for Week 1 action. And as you can tell, I'm at the home of the Purdue Boilermakers. I love the Big Ten action as well as the SEC. I would have to say those are my two favorite conferences. And this sure should be a great game to watch Thursday night, September 1. So, with that said, I'm going to start talking about live in-game betting. In addition to the angle of the day, of course. But in this game, when you think that the game is going to be nip and tuck uh, more than anything else, as opposed to a blowout by one team or the other, I like Penn State in this matchup quite a bit. But I can't take away the talent that is on the Purdue Boilermakers offensive line and offense in general. They have a returning quarterback that threw for 534 yards and five touchdowns in the Music City Bowl last year against an SEC team called the Tennessee Volunteers, and that was quite impressive. And that's what Penn State's going to be going up against, and they have four defensive returning starters. But I'm not too worried about Penn State's defense here. What I'm hoping is that Penn or Purdue scores first, and that may sound ridiculous, but I'm on Penn State. 50% of the bet that I normally make is going to be done pre-flop before the game starts, and then I'm going to look for Purdue to score a touchdown in the first quarter. And if they do, I'm all over the rest of the 50% live in-game bet probably at about a pick em price and that's my in-game strategy for the week the angle of the day is pretty simple we are going to bet on favorites of three to nine and a half points in the first four weeks of the regular season the favorite closed out the previous season with two or more losses the opponent closed out the previous seasons with three or more wins pretty simple stuff it comes up to a 32 and 10 76 percent winning record last 30 se- seasons I am on Penn State, and if you have any questions about that live in-game betting, check me out with a direct message over at Twitter at John Ryan Sports and the number one. Thanks a lot for listening. Bet with your heads, not over it. And we'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow for another edition of the NCAA Football Week 1 Angle of the Day.